Ladies and gentlemen, I am making this video today because, well, it, it's August and uh, I'm running low on video ideas, so I figured why not put myself through some pain, some suffering, and some rage for your entertainment. Hey, I'm Wolf. I'm Facebook. What's up, Facebook? I sent you a Facebook message yesterday. I still haven't heard anything back. Oh man, that just sucks. Getting your Facebook message ignored. I've been there. If only there was a way to make sure that person gets your communication. You should have sent me a Wolf. A what? When you send a Wolf, it goes to your home phone, cell phone, email, Facebook, Twitter, and home screen. Okay, that seems like a little bit overkill for a website to have all those platforms connected, but maybe if it had a catchy tagline or title, I would really be sold on it. Wolf.com. I'm sorry, Wolf? Com. I gotta be honest, that uh, that name is the dog's breakfast, wolf.com. That really isn't it, but hey, if you really want to go forward with that, Ryan and Michael, I have a great place that you can go and make your wolf.com website. Wolf.com! Today's video is brought to you by Squarespace. From websites and online stores to marketing tools and analytics, Squarespace is the all-in-one platform to build beautiful online presences and run your business. If you're looking to market yourself or expand into business online, Squarespace is a great way to get set up with a website. You can see how many people are visiting your site, how many unique visitors, you can see all the different traffic so you can know how to better market yourself and your product to other people. It's a really simple platform as well. You can see the beautiful designs you can create there and it's done without plugins, anything else to bog up your computer. Just like on YouTube or Facebook or anything else, there's a completely integrated commenting system supporting threaded comments and all of them show individual like counts. And as well, you can schedule entries, schedule posts to be published in the future. I really, really urge you guys, if you're interested in making a website or building your online presence, head to squarespace.com. You can get a free trial. And when you're ready to launch publicly, go to squarespace.com backslash jcanada and you'll save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Now, I hope you are all entertained by this video and time will tell, obviously, because I know that I'm not going to because today we're doing the worst 99 Opal lineup in NBA 2K19. Like, anybody can use the best cards in the game and have a lot of fun, but no, I'm using the worst, and I'm having, well, th it's not gonna be a lot of fun. I actually put this out in tweet form asking you guys who the worst Opals were, and the replies were really funny because they were pretty much every single Opal point guard other than, like, Magic and Ben Simmons, and listen, I agree, like, go off Kings on Twitter because point guards this year, just brutal. But there were also a few other, you know, big man suggestions, and I use my experience with some of the cards that I just hate using and you know why, why not throw why not throw them all in a lineup why am I doing this is this is gonna be dumb and 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 sad now as you can see we do not have a full lineup as of yet but uh, we'll get it filled out before the game I just wanted to start with these six cards you're stupid because I know for a fact that they are garbage. Oh wait, there's seven cards right here. Did I say six earlier? I meant seven. Chris Paul, Allen Iverson, and CJ McCollum. Each of these three cards should be so good. Like their stats are really nice, but they suffer from being under like six foot three height. I can't relate to that pain, but these boys can, and that makes their cards just terrible. This AI card costs 750 tokens. Imagine, imagine 2K making us spend 750 tokens on this dude. Like it's just, he's so bad. Moving on to the bench, at least these cards became really cheap like instantly from the Raptors championship run Lowry Van Vliet I, I can't say anything about them they're just short and they're not good I know some people are gonna be mad when we putting Wilt on this list but Wilt was really good when he first dropped but that was so early in the year now he's one of the only big men the opal big man who can't shoot same with Dikembe I mean Dikembe is a fine card but just these two cards can't shoot every other opal big man can so that's why they make their way onto this team. To fill out the other three slots in the lineup, I'm gonna drop in an Opal Brian Scalabrini. I know, I know, sacrilegious to put the White Mamba, the GOAT in here, but for 750 tokens, this card is really not worth it. I've used this Kevin Garnett a couple times. They did speed up his jumper, but for me, he's still, eh, he, he's not up there with Carl Malone or Blake Griffin for power forwards. And if I had to choose a small forward to drop in here, I would put Luca. No, Luca! <laughs> just because his shot release is slow. Like James Worthy, Jan, all these guys have other attributes that make him so much better, but Luca, his slow shot release, it's just, you know, I don't love using him. And there you have it, guys, in my opinion, the worst 99 Opal lineup in 2K19. Let me know if I missed anybody. I am gonna rage so much in this game. I have three players under six foot three in the starting lineup. I'm literally gonna get smacked in this game. This is not gonna be good. <laughs> They're just gonna shoot over me every time. What am I doing? Please, 2K, bless me with an opponent. Oh, okay. It's not all Opal, but he's got all tall people. That is the one thing 
We, we couldn't f why all tall people seriously okay let's just let it fly though last time i used this chris paul card with the pelican scheme he was actually not bad so maybe he's no Ooh, will chamberlain almost missed that dunk but we got it honestly though like how how are we gonna defend how good pass brian scalabrini right off bonga's back uh see no i that was smothered wilt on the glass again all right will just let me know that i disrespected you by putting you on this team fair enough my brother Oh, look at AI. AI sneaking out there. Get the shot off quick. He got his feet set. That's got to be bucket. <laughs> Let's go. Allen freaking Iverson, man. If he's open, he's an opal, but it's just, you know, getting him open. That's the problem. Uh, can we defend? No, no. Wilt, you hero. Oh my gosh. Wilt is really d up right now. CJ. Oh, that's a green. That's a green. A perfect release for a perfect start to this game. Let's get it. We ain't getting ahead of ourselves here. We are not getting ahead of ourselves. CP3, I'm going with the ice. Oh, 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 CP3 on Bongo. Oh, that cross. Floater, please, please. Uh, <laughs> it was smothered. He made it and it was smothered. Oh my gosh. All right, 2K. They uh, they are they are with the August content. They are not wanting me to rage right now. Expose him. Expose him. AI. <laughs> Dude, I just got Jason Richardson on sk sk Kate's. Yeah, that was nice. AI with the dunk. Let's go. Pick and fake. Can you space the floor, CP3? Oh, we don't need to. Brian Scow is open. Bad release. Oh, my word. Dude, this man, Wilt, has six points and three rebounds in like a minute. <laughs> He's so good. What in the world? The disrespect for me to put Wilt on this team. Let's go with slashing takeover. Oh, right the rip. <laughs> Wow, he's a bit of a glitch even still. What was I thinking? If Will can hit a three-pointer for me, then it's just like everything I said was a lie. All right, everything I said was a lie. Let's bring it up here, Will. That's actually pretty good. Look. Will Chamberlain mid-range. Will <laughs> no, Will. Oh, man. I'm getting a little drunk on Will. Oh, that's why, though. I'm drunk. On no, don't turn this ball over. I'm drunk on Will because he's so freaking good. Wait, what? What? How did that? Oh, my goodness. Two kid. No, don't let him. Hit. Don't. Don't. Th thank you. Yeah, you don't let him hit that after a dumb turnover. Come on. Come on, AI cutting back door. Yeah, right there. This is why we don't use AI. This is why we don't use short people. They just get swatted. And now the game is somehow... I'm losing. I knew we weren't going to be able to play defense in this game, but like 22 points allowed in the first quarter. That is not good. Come on, bench. No, wait. Post fade? Post... Oh my gosh. They really let this Isaac Bond get post fades too. I I'm, I'm not surprised, actually. I'm not. Oh, Dikembe. Oh, Dikembe with the spin. Okay. This boy can't shoot threes, but apparently he can spin like prime D Wade out here. All right. And we D up inside. That was all Dikembe again. Oh, with the... Re Come on. I literally just grab a rebound and immediately I'm str I hate that. Come on, KG. Oh, look at Luca back door. Yeah, Luca. Yeah, yeah. Kick it out, Luca. Over there, Freddie Van Vliet. Full white bar. Let's go. That's good offense right there. Fred in the corner. Oh, good steal, Luca Doncic. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did not mean to pass that right away. Freddie Van Vliet back door. Yes. I actually thought I was passing that to Lowry. They switched icons on me, but we get the dunk either way. Fred Van Vliet, let's go, let's, let's go, Fred Van Vliet with the momentum spin. I do remember the one good thing about this card. that steal all right everybody stay down we're d up yep yep no we're there we're there give me this steal oh i read that i'm so good i'm so good at this game right now i don't know what happened i used to be so bad and now i'm so good again wilt underneath pump fake yep yep how about an and one 2k how about you show wilt some respect okay let me chill let me chill we're tied though bring it inside i i, I literally dare you i literally dare you. oh yeah right there that's what we want <laughs> let me chill let me, let me let me chill. Yeah, he just scored on me. Not, not, not good. No. What? He just pulled up a mid-range jumper with Patrick. E wow, with Patrick Ewing. Okay. Every time I get a lead in this game, 2K is like, no, nah, no, nah, we're good. All right, let's go right to the post with Will Chamberlain. Let's go. That was not what I meant to do. I'll take the basket. Will almost has 20. We're almost in the lead. Tell him to bring me my money. Yeah! Excuse me? What? What? Opponent has left my my guy. We we were in a good game. What? 
I mean, okay, I get the win, like, we all know that, but, uh, that's, that's actually really disappointing. <laughs> I was having fun making this video after all. That's too bad, I was looking forward to a good fourth quarter. Well, what can you do, right? <laughs> My guy was so scared of me that he just, he just hopped out of the game. Actually, that's really weird, like, he wasn't really pausing before, maybe he just had something to do. <laughs> I actually have no idea, but, hey, we were actually balling with this, I just said actually, like, 45 times. Let me stop that. We were, as a matter of fact... Ah, see, better. We were, as a matter of fact, really hooping with this team. Like, obviously, super small. He was abusing the CJ with, like, LeBron. But for a group of the worst Opals, and I do believe these are the worst, Um, we were about to win that game, or at least, you know, lose by a couple, which isn't too bad at all. But I hope you guys did enjoy this, the worst 99 Opal lineup challenge. Be sure to check out another video or two from the end slate. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. That's all I got for this one, guys. I'm Jay Canada. You all stay golden.